moving on to the second part of the lecture, this is going to cover the classification of local anesthetics, the structural activity relationships, the types of local anesthesia, the choice of local anesthesia. So coming to the classification, it is divided broadly into four categories based on the origin, based on the structure, based on the duration and based on mechanism. Let's start the lecture by seeing one by one in detail. Coming to the classification of local anesthetics, the local anesthetics can be classified based on their origin, based on the structure, based on the duration of action and based on the mechanism of action. So let us take one by one in detail, first based on origin. Based on origin, the local anesthetics can be classified into different categories like natural resources, that is example cocaine, synthetic nitrogenous compound, example procaine, benzocaine, lignocaine and bufacaine. Non-nitrogenous compounds, benzyl alcohol, miscellaneous compounds, clove oil and phenol. Based on the structure, they can be broadly classified into two categories as amino esters and amino amides. Some of the examples under esters are cocaine, procaine, chloroprocaine and tetracaine, whereas under amino amides are lidocaine, prilocaine and so on. Based on the duration of action, they can be categorized into ultra-short acting anesthetic, short acting local anesthetic, medium acting and longer acting. In case of ultra short acting, they act less than 30 minutes. Short acting, the duration of action is less than 45 to 75 minutes. Whereas in medium acting, it is 90 to 150 and in longer acting, it is 180 minutes. And the examples are shown in the slide. Moving on to the mechanism of action, they can be categorized into four classes. Class A are the agents acting at receptor site on external surface of thermal membrane, example biotoxins. Class B, agents acting at receptor site on internal surface of nerve membrane, example scorpion venom. Class C, agents acting by receptor independent physiochemical mechanism, example benzocaine. Class D, agents acting in combination of receptor dependent and independent mechanism, example lidocaine and mephiocaine. Moving on to the structure activity relationships of local anesthetics. In, in the structure of local anesthetics, you have four components. One is the lipophilic component, that is the lipophilic center, ester or amide group, a bridge, that is, which is uh, nothing but short C chain containing oxygen, nitrogen and sulfur, and the hydrophilic center. If you take the structure of procaine, there you can see an aromatic ring, which is the lipophilic moiety, and there is a carboxy intermediate chain and an amino moiety which is hydrophilic moiety. Whereas in case of xylocaine or the lidocaine, there is an aromatic ring which is followed by an ester intermediate chain followed by the amino linkage that is the hydrophilic moiety. The lipophilic moiety is responsible for the lipid solubility of the drug. So the local anesthetic activity of benzoic acid derivatives increase if RL lipophilic center as electron donating group and decrease with electron withdrawing substances. This is because of the electron donor, donor substituent increases the binding to the receptor. Those with amide functional group bind more strongly to receptor site. 95% of bufiocaine bound to plasma and tissue proteins compared with 55% of prilocaine. Let us see the few synthesis of the local anesthetic starting with procaine. Procaine is synthesized from 4 amino benzoic acid on treatment with 2 ethyl diamino ethanol, which leads to the synthesis of procaine. Next comes lidocaine, 2 6 xylidine on treatment with chloroacetyl chloride. On condensation, you are going to get lidocaine. Coming to the synthesis of benzocaine, 4 nitrotoluene on potassium permanganate use 4 nitrobenzoic acid, which on esterification forms 4 nitro ethyl benzoate, which on reduction forms benzocaine. Moving on to the synthesis of dibucane, dibucane is starting material is isatin, which on acetylation followed by series of reactions leads to the formation of dibucane. Coming to the choice of Local anesthetics. The local anesthetics are chosen based on four different categories. One is the onset of action, next is the duration of action, then the technique of anesthesia that is going to be deployed, and finally the potential of toxicity should be less. And they are also, if we come to the onset of 
of action and duration of action esters. In case of procaine, they are slow and the duration is short. Whereas chloropocaine, the onset is fast, the duration is short. Tetracaine, the onset is slow and the duration is long. In case of amides like dilocaine, bifocaine, the onset is fast and the duration is moderate. Similarly, based on the techniques, that is, for topical application, the appropriate drugs are cocaine, tetracaine and lidocaine, whereas for infiltration anesthesia, procaine and lidocaine are preferred, whereas for peripheral nerve block, chloroprocaine, lidocaine and mephiocaine are preferred, for spinal anesthesia, procaine, tetracaine and lidocaine are preferred, whereas epidural anesthesia, we prefer lidocaine, bufiocaine and so on, and for IV region anesthesia, lidocaine is the preferred one. Coming to the application of local anesthetics, the local anesthetics are applied in different routes and different surgeries. 